After winning a crazy one in extra innings last night, the Titans look to take the weekend series from their rivals, the Long Beach State Dirtbacks. Top of the first, and center fielder Tyler Steve starts out strong for the Titans, taking this pitch from Long Beach starter Chris Matthewson and driving it right back up the middle for a leadoff single. The Titans rally would stall though, and the Dirtbags didn't wait long to get runners in scoring position, as Zach Riviera, with one runner on, takes this pitch from Fullerton starter John Gavin and rips it to left field for a double. Both runners scored one batter later because of a throwing error by catcher A.J. Kennedy. Later in the first, with three runs already in, things turn from bad to worse when Long Beach State first baseman Jonathan Servin hits a pop-up that drops right in the middle of three Fullerton players, bringing in the fourth run of the inning. Let's go to the top of the sixth, where Fullerton, now down 5-0, finally gets one back after Dalton Blazer hits a grounder to short that Garrett Hampson just can't handle. This drives in Davi Olmeda Barrera for the Titans' first run of the game. It turned out to be their only run though as Tristan Hillebrand came in to pinch hit in the top of the ninth, but his ground out to Hampson at short would end the game. The Titans fall to 11-11 on the season, and they fall to 1-2 on this 8 game road trip, while Long Beach State moves to 12-8 overall. Coach Vanderhoek was very open about his team's struggles in the post-game press conference, including one very bold prediction that may shock Titan fans. I predict us to probably end the 40-year streak of winning seasons. Oh wow, that is a, that's a big prediction. It's right a bold there. prediction, but when you can't play baseball and other teams can, you have trouble winning. Titans lose a tough one, six to one against the Long Beach State Dirtbags, and they lose the series two games to one. Four first-run innings were just too much for the Titans to come back from. They look to turn it around against Nebraska in Nebraska next Tuesday. From Blair Field, I'm Kyle Lowe, Titan Sports Recap.